Bob Johnson's Computer Stuff, Inc., the Panasonic Tough Book Experts. Hi, I'm Solomon with Bob Johnson's Computer Stuff, Inc. Today we're going to show you how to remove and replace the Gobi 2000 or WAN sled for a Panasonic Tough Book CF30. This is a fairly easy tutorial as we will not be installing any of the Gobi WAN antenna wires or the Gobi sled itself. We are simply just removing the Gobi WAN sled. These tutorials for that installation can be found on our YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe. First step what we're going to do is we're going to remove the battery and hard drive. We've already removed the battery and hard drive for this specific laptop, so there is no need for us to do it, but at this time, you should remove the battery and hard drive by opening these two bay doors to assure that your laptop is anti-static. Next, we're gonna remove the back plate. You do this by turning your tough book over on its top screen bezel, and then you're gonna now remove the screws for the back plate. Each screw is marked with a red circle. I'm using a Craftsman 1x2 Craftsman Phillips head screwdriver. I'm simply going to remove this center screw. I'll place this to the side for now. Once you've removed all the screws, next, lift the back plate up. If this is the first time you've removed the back plate, there may be a sticky adhesive around the edges of the back plate. You may have to use a flathead screwdriver to pry the back plate up. Now, typically you won't need to remove the back plate to remove this sled, but I'm showing you how to remove the back plate because I want you to see it connecting here. This sled has a connector piece that goes into the system board here, and you need to make sure that it's connecting correctly or else that will cause issues. So what we're now gonna do is we're gonna remove these two screws for the cover right next to the battery bay door located here and here. That's our first screw and now here's for our second. Here we go. There we go. And now that we've removed the two screws, we can now slightly open our LCD display and then lift the connector or cover bracket for the Gobi Wawan sled. Now, if I turn my computer over like this, you'll see that the sled slides right out just like that. Here's your Gobi card, covered by a piece of tape. You see the antennas connecting so this sled is quintessentially all of the pieces needed to connect your Gobi card to your CF30 and to make it um, connect to mobile broadband. So now we're gonna replace this Gobi card. And I want you to make sure that the connectors are sliding in there correctly. And all you need to do is slightly push it and it pops right in. At this point, you can close the battery bay door. Next, we're gonna replace the back plate. Make sure you've kept track of all these screws as you'll be replacing them now. As for me, I'm just gonna replace this center screw here, but I'll mark each screw hole with a red circle that needs to be removed. And now we're gonna replace this cover bracket here for the sled by slightly opening up the battery bay door and then replacing the bracket cover. Next, we're gonna replace these two screws. Time for our single screw, and there you go. At this point, you can also replace the battery and hard drive for your laptop. Uh, we're not gonna do that. 
but feel free to complete that step on your own. Thanks for tuning in. If you have any questions, feel free to comment. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Until next time here at Bob Johnson's Computer Stuff Inc. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.